Hi guys, I'm back again today with another video for y'all. I went out shopping at Walmart today and these are some of the awesome finds I found. Now, I didn't have a whole lot of manufacturer coupons this time for some of the products and there are coupons out for some of them and I'll tell you about that as we go along. But some of them I just didn't have the coupons for but I was trying to hit my level two and get close to getting level three. So that's why I did a lot of these deals. And a lot of this is food, so we can eat a lot of it. So the first thing I bought was this lip balm right here. It's the Carmex Daily Care Lip Balm. If you go to their website, there's a 25 cent off printable coupon that you can do. And then there's also a rebate back on Ibotta for 35 cents, which makes this guy really cheap at 38 cents for some Carmex lip care. The next thing I bought was some degree deodorant. Now these are found in the travel section. I bought five of them. They are 97 cents a piece. And then there's a rebate back on checkout 51 for a dollar 50 back on degree deodorant for the men's. Men's only, not the women's. Make sure you get the men's. And that makes that, if the rebate goes through, I just scanned my receipt, so I'm hoping it works. Soldier Girl, shout out to her. Saving with Shay. She told me about this deal. She said it was working. I'm assuming it still is. And you make $2.65 by buying these travel size deodorants if it's still working on this size. If not, get your bigger ones if you need some deodorant. The next thing I bought was this glucernum. These snack bars right here. This is the chocolate, chocolate and peanut butter flavor. They are priced at $4.28 at my store. I had a $3 off coupon that I got from my doctor's office. Then there is a rebate back on Ibotta for a dollar, making these really cheap at $0.28, cents, which is some good prices for some snacks. Especially for Gusana, because that stuff's expensive. The next thing I bought was this Mentos Pure Gum. Now, I know I had a rebate on Ibotta on one of my accounts for it for 25 cents, but on my other account, it wasn't there. So you may or may not have this rebate anymore, but it's still pretty cheap gum. It's only 96 cents for gum, and it's some pretty good gum. So decide if you want to do this deal or not check your ibotta rebate and see if it's there if it's there then i'll be even cheaper but if not then it's just 96 cents okay. the next thing i bought was the tic tacs so i bought the tic tac gum peppermint and then i got the tic tac gum spearmint so i can't hold both up at the same time but make sure you get both varieties the spearmint and the peppermint not get the red one which is uh cinnamon i'm believe i'm assuming i don't know exactly what flavor it is but do not get the red one get the blue and get the green there you go it's close i told me about that so when you buy one they are priced at a dollar 14 each and then times two and make that two dollars and 28 cents and then we have two separate rebates back on ibotta for each one 50 cents back on this one and then 50 cents back on this one. So that makes these really cheap at a dollar eighteen. And then I also had a 50 cent off coupon. So hold on. Sixty-eight cents. If it was a I believe it was a fifty cent coupon. Now you can print that more than once, but I only Printed it once accidentally. I forgot. I was in a hurry this morning and didn't get all my prints done. So if you print both of those, they make these only 18 cents for two packs of Tic Tac Gum. So but 68 cents is not a bad price for two. Then the next thing I got is this Kikomon breadcrumbs. See, these will be good. Kikomon Pinko breadcrumbs. These will be good to make dinner with one night. They are priced at a dollar fifty six. Now I had that fifty five cent off any Kikomon product coupon from their website that I printed, and it'll let me print one more. So I printed that. 
then it came, and then there's a 50 cent I bought a rebate making these dirt cheap for some breadcrumbs at 51 cents. That's a good price for breadcrumbs, in my opinion. The next thing I bought was this giant ass can. You know, I say that every time I get this stuff. Then Contendina tomatoes. It's the whole peeled this time. I didn't get crushed. I got the whole peeled. You can do either one, crushed or whole peeled. And they are priced at $1.54. There is a 50 cent rebate back on Ibotta, making them $1.04. Now, if you have that printable coupon on coupons.com, which I think is in LA, no longer available anymore, but it may still be. I just didn't ha see it when I looked today, or yesterday. So check your check yours and see if you can find it. And that make it even cheaper. That would make it fifty cents less, which would be a good price. But a dollar oh four for a giant can of tomatoes is not a bad price. Then the next thing I bought was some mustard. I got this Molly, Molly. I guess is how you pronounce that. Dijon original mustard. Make sure you get the Dijon. I don't. I'm assuming the honey Dijon works too, but make sure you get Dijon specifically because of the rebates we have. We have a rebate back on Ibotta for the mustard, and currently there are no coupons out. This is two dollars and ninety-eight cents for this mustard at the store. There is a a dollar fifty rebate back on Ibotta for this. Then there is also a rebate back on Checkout 51 for $1.25. So that makes this fancy expensive jarred mustard $0.23, cents, which is a stock up killer price for mustard. So if you have two accounts, do this still twice. This is a stock up killer price for mustard because French's mustard alone is like $1.50. Fifty something like that. Even store brands aren't cheap. So to get this seven point five ounces for that is a good price in my book. Then the next to last thing I got was this PF Chang sauce. It's the teriyaki brand sauce. It looked good to me, so I figured I would try it, and it is priced at three dollars and thirty eight cents. Now there was a PF Chang's coupon floating around out there for two dollars. But as far as I can tell, it's no longer available to print. But if you have any left, go ahead and definitely use that. Or if you can find some, definitely use that. They are $3.38. And then there's a $1.50 back rebate on Ibotta. So that makes that cheap at $1.88, guys. That is cheap on a hard up price. Hold on one second. Plugging in phone. Then the last thing I bought on this receipt was this Kikamon sauce. And now this is a teriyaki based and based and glazed sauce. So you can baste and glaze your meat with it. Or you could just use it to mix or fry out of whatever you wanted to do with it. Anyways, it is priced at $1.98. Then there is a 50 cent back on one. I bought a rebate making this really cheap. Hold on. That makes that a dollar forty-eight, which isn't a bad price for Kikamon products. Now, if you can get that fifty cent, fifty-five cent printable, that'll make that ninety-three cents. If you have the fifty-five cent printable, now I didn't have any more. I only had the one left because I couldn't print anymore. I've already printed my limits, so. That is a good price for this, and I'm going to try this. I keep getting the stir-fry sauce and then the sweet and sour, but I figured I'd try the Kikamon teriyaki this time, just to be different. Have a good day.